Good afternoon, this is Jim Lakey with news and announcements for St. John, Kansas and, and for Maxville on Cable Channel 3 and on cnumancenter.org, our website. Today is Thursday, it's the 19th of January. It's 46 here in the square at noon time. And we're looking for a cloudy day today. They think 47 will be the high, so it won't change much from what it is right now. And uh, 34 will be the low, and we continue to have a lot of days uh, that don't go below freezing at night. Now, Friday will be one that does. Friday is cloudy and 47 again for the high. But at night time, it'll get to 29, so it'll be slightly below freezing. Then Saturday will be sunny, and the high temperature will be 58 if you want to, oh, I'm sorry, 53 if you uh, can believe that, warm the temperature. And the low will be 32. Then on uh, Monday, even better, 53 again, the high temperature, and 37 the low. And then we get back into things that are more normal. Uh, Tuesday will be sunny and uh, 44 the high, 25 the low. Uh, Wednesday will be partly cloudy uh, and it will be incre it'll be windy. And 41 will be the high and 25 will be the low again. And having it be 40 and the low of 25 is kind of normal for this time of year, where having it be 53 and the, the, high, the low be 34 or 37, that's, that's unusual for this time of the year. So, uh, it seems like there's climate change and some folks think it's getting warmer and I think that's good. I don't know. All right, well, we go on with the news, and we've got happy anniversary to Larry and Luann Fisher, and we have happy birthday, uh, that's today, and tomorrow happy birthday to Gabriel uh, Roach tomorrow. And we don't have uh, many announcements, but the, the main one is that uh, I've checked with the city, and it's the city's intention to collect all of the wood that's in front, you know, by the curb in, in front of your house. Uh, but they aren't going to do it. It'll probably be longer than two weeks because the first thing they have to do is protect all the wires that have things hanging on them and help the people whose electric wire has been knocked down or ripped out and restore power to everybody in the city and also the places that have uh, dangerous uh, tree limbs and things on a cable that would take out one section of the city or another. And so they're going to do all that first before they go around and help us out with what we leave on the side of the road in our yard. Uh, and but they are going to come in and uh, help take away that. And uh, so if you... I mean, a lot of people are just having it done. There are folks that will take your uh, wood to the yard or uh, help you cut things up, uh, and, and you can uh, pay them. Uh, but if you've piled it up yourself and you either can't afford or don't really want to uh, take it over yourself, you can put it on the curb, and someday they will get there probably later than two weeks from now. But we'll keep you in touch when they tell me they're going to do it. We'll put it on the news right away. Uh, so that's uh, the good news. I guess it's good news and bad news. The good news is they're going to do it. The bad news is it's not going to be for a while. Well, we come to uh, another thing that's good news. and. Uh, Monday through Thursday at the Wet Center, the Sunflowers have a thing come call Walk With Me, and from 1.30 to 2, uh, they encourage everybody getting together and walking around the skating rink. 
You can use walkers and canes on the floor, and uh, this is a good chance to get to see people, but it's a safer way to do your walking exercise, which most of us are supposed to be doing every day, a certain number of minutes of walking, and it's a good way to do that in a safe place. I know it, it always uh, concerned me when I would try to walk around the block or something like that, that I could uh, step on a rock or uh, trip over something and not be paying attention to where I'm stepping. And if you're walking around the skating rink, there's not going to be any ice to slip on or anything to trip over. So, way to go, sunflowers, uh, to have that walking program. Now, uh, the last thing in the month uh, that we have as a trip is movie night, and it's somewhere and uh, some movie, and they're waiting to see what's playing before they announce what it is. But save January 28th, which is a Saturday, for a movie night. And uh, by next Tuesday, I'm going to make sure I call and find out if they have got that figured out yet. Now, uh, the last thing, and a very important thing, is the menu of the fellowship meal at the Sunflowers. And uh, today they're having baked ham, au gratin potatoes, and spinach. On Friday they're having bean soup, crackers, a ham sandwich. Uh, and on uh, Monday they're having uh, meat sauce, spaghetti, and asparagus, tossed salad, and other things. And then on Tuesday they're having herb baked chicken, baked potato with toppings, spinach, uh, red peach crisp. So, all these things are going on and uh, things can help to be getting better and we even have a super word of the day. Goodness consists not in the outward things we do, but in the inward things that we are. Well, we pray you have a good day today and that we don't have any more nasty storms like that for another 15 years. Anyway, have a good day. This is Jim Lecky.